I quit. Forget it. Goodbye. See ya. Yeah, it's the Shop King. Yeah, it's Shop King time. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Shop King in the house. Today, we are going to be talking about the top 10 items that Animal Jam should make rare. 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 And these are items that have been out for a while. They don't have a rare tag on them. Once an item gets a rare tag, that means that it is not going to ever come back to the store. You will never be able to buy it again. For example, this is something they did with Medusa masks. There used to be a whole bunch of different versions of it, and then they removed it from stores, and then they made it rare and now there's new versions available in the store. So all of the old ones, you can't get them anymore in the store. Like, they will never come back. But there's a lot of other items out there that I think Animal Jam should make rare. Like, they should never bring these back to the store. So let's go ahead and get started. Number 10 on the list is the Royal Tiara. Royal Tiaras are a pretty popular item. They come in some decent colors. They've been out for a while. And I think a lot of people would be upset if they brought Royal Tiaras back into the store. So no, don't do that. Put a rare tag on it. Put a rare tag on it. Throw the rare tag on the Royal Tiara. Royal Tiara, rare tag. It just makes sense. We got some other head items on our list, including top hats. Top hats have been around Animal Jam since forever. Okay, and actually a while back they did re-release, they brought them back into the game. You could go buy as many top hats as you want and a lot of people were upset about that because it totally messed up the value of top hats. So this is definitely another item that they need to put a rare tag on and never bring it back to the store. Okay, up next, we got another head item. We got another head item. The Mech Angel Helmet. Wow, that actually looks really good on a red panda. I don't think I've ever put one of those on a red panda. I like that a lot. Mech Helmets are one of my favorite items. A lot of people like these and they haven't been available in stores forever so it just makes sense that the mech helmets deserve to have a rare tag they should be rare and all that really means is that they'll never bring it back to the store and that just makes sense you shouldn't re-release a popular item into the store that just messes everything up think about the guy who has collected like 50 mech helmets or whatever or he just traded a whole bunch of his items and he finally got a mech helmet and then the next day you put mech helmets into the store you just ruin that guy's whole life <laughs> so mech helmets is another item that definitely needs a rare tag up next is one that i think we can all agree on yes the worn blankie Everybody loves worn blankies. I, I don't know why they're so popular. I don't I, I don't think I've ever used a worn blankie on a look. I don't know. It's just an old ripped blanket. I don't really know what the big deal is about it. But I do like the item. Like whenever I get a worn blanket, I'm happy about it. And if it came back to Jam Art, I would be furious. And I think a lot of you would be very mad too so animal jam throw a rip throw throw a throw a basketball at my face throw a rare tag on worn blankets they should all be rare all of them and then you know what if you want to you can re-release worn blankets in a whole bunch of different colors right because they don't have worn blankets in so many different colors. Green and orange and you know, just come out with some crazy worn blankets and put rare tags on the old ones so we don't have to worry about it anymore. Deal? Okay, 
Up next is an item that I think everyone really likes. Flower crowns. Everybody loves flower crowns, right? What's not to like? They're flowers and they're crowns and they look good and they look cute. And you know you would be upset if they brought flower crowns back. Don't act like you wouldn't, baby. It's not cool. You can't bring these back ever. So put a rare tag on them. And then if you want to, you can release some new ones with different colors. I'd be okay with that. But never, ever, ever re-release these. Ever. And since we have agreed on that, you might as well put a rare tag on it. That's my opinion. I don't, I don't understand why you wouldn't. Just makes sense to me. Up next, Arctic Hoods. Come on, Arctic Hoods are nice. Everyone likes Arctic Hoods. You can trade them for a Den Beta. They have very good value. And there's some pretty cool colors out there. So this is another item. It just makes no sense that they would ever bring it back. And if you're never gonna bring it back, you might as well put the rare tag on it. And I wouldn't mind seeing new colors of Arctic Hoods. I really wouldn't. And you can, instead of making this white, you can make it like two, like so many different colors. Like what if you did this part green and then this part blue? Or this part purple and then this part pink? You know, go crazy with it. Animal Jam, go nuts. I, I don't care. The more items, the better, in my opinion. Some people disagree. Some people think Animal Jam are, is just releasing way too many items and they put out a thousand different spikes and all of this other stuff. I don't think there's a such thing as too many items. They could put out a hundred brand new items every single day. And that would be perfectly fine with me. I, I think it's fun. Number four on my list is my favorite tail item. Can anybody guess what it is? You guessed it, Scullies. This is the only item on this list that is kinda new, I guess. Uh, so some people might be like, eh, I don't know about those. But yeah, I, I know about those. I don't want to see these in the store again. I want a rare tag on those and I want them to come out with brand new colors of those because I love them. On every look, when all else fails, when I can't find the perfect tail, I always go to Scully's. But they just don't have enough colors. Like sometimes you're making a look, like what, where's the pink Scully's at? Where are the pink scullies? So make pink scullies, please. And make these rare. <laughs> Let me know if you agree with me in the comments. Okay, moving on. And I think this is one we can all agree on. If you have a problem with this, then, then I think you're crazy. Cupid wings. Could you imagine if you got onto Animal Jam tomorrow and all of a sudden Cupid wings were in jam art? There would be a riot in Jamal. It, 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 it would be nuts. People would be going crazy. You can't bring Cupid wings back. And what about the glossy Cupid wings? Like, at least make those rare. Right? Right? They should never ever ever bring Cupid wings back. Unless... Oh. You're welcome. Unless they make these rare, and the cupid wings that they bring back are totally different colors. They make a yellow one, and make um, a dark purple one, and then like they need dark green, and they need this darker light blue. I don't know, just like every color. Oh, I wanna see every color of cupid wings. Number two, my second favorite tail is the raccoon tail. They actually did a Rare Item Monday version of this, and I, I really hate this tail because this blue, it doesn't match 
anything in the world. I mean, there's like one or two items in the whole game that matches this blue, and you can't even, like, get this blue any, any, wait, no, that's way too dark. Yeah, you can't get that blue anywhere. It's like, why did, who picked this color? Nothing matches it. That's just a little bit of frustration. But these other ones, they were from the carnival. Only place you could get them was the carnival. And they removed them from the carnival. And usually when they remove an item from the carnival, they throw the rare tag on it. They did that with the pizza hats, the star hats, the moon hats and sun hats and a whole bunch of different items. And I think it only makes sense to do it with these also. These should definitely be made rare. And all that means is that they're not coming back to the store. It doesn't mean they're automatically worth more or anything like that. It just means that you don't have to worry about your item all of a sudden coming back to the store. But Raccoon Tails, I mean, there are so many different like option possibilities so many different like a red and black one you know that would be cool like this blue instead of this blue do one with this blue one that matches do a purple and pink one do orange and yellow oh black and gray even so many possibilities. I love Raccoon Tails. I would just love to see more colors. I also feel the same way about Scullies, that they should make one one color and another another color. Purple and pink Scullies. Come on, that would be awesome. You have got to admit that would be awesome. Please admit that. Will you admit it? Come on, imagine that there was a blue and a magenta scully. <laughs> okay, that's that's more for me. But you would like that. If it if it matched your look, like if your look was tan and green, and they made a tan and green one, you would love it. Okay, it's time for the number one item on our list. I think some of you probably know what it is, and once I say what it is, if you don't know what it is, you'll probably be like, oh yeah, well that, that makes sense, I agree about that. It's a neck item, and it is the very first diamond spikes ever. These came out five years ago, and in the past five years, they came back one time for three days. So three days in the past five years, they came back. So they're probably never ever bringing these back to Animal Jam ever. I love all of these spikes. They're unique. If you're working on a tan or brown look, this is your, your best option, right? If you're working on a pink and blue look or like a gold and white look, I mean these, Look at that, silver and white. These diamond spikes are so awesome. I love them so much. They're actually pretty rare. I mean, they're all rarer than this, uh, if you can believe that. All of these are way rarer than this. And if you don't know why, or if you don't believe me, please understand that people get these every single day. There are more and more and more of these coming into the game every day in the Forgotten Desert. And plus there's other adventures where you can win spikes. So the rare spikes, there's just more and more and more of them coming in, into the game. But the diamond spikes, these are awesome. These old ones, they should never bring them back. They should put a rare tag on them. And I know a lot of people feel like, oh my god, they're just... Spikes of Palooza, the Spike Cell, they're bringing all these spikes. Like ancient spike, and double spike, and the spiked, spiked collar, and the spiked worn custom alien spiked spike. So, yeah, I feel you. I feel you. There's a million different spikes. It's kind of ridiculous. But you know what? 
I say there's no such thing as too many spikes. It doesn't bother me at all. They can release a new spike every single day and I'm perfectly fine with it. I mean, you go to games like Roblox and Minecraft, there's millions of items. So I think it's just fun for the players to see all the new items and stuff like this. Some people hated this, but I thought it was cool. I would love to see more different color combinations. Wait, this one is rare. That means it's never coming back. I never really thought about that. These rare ones will never be re-released. Hmm, that's interesting. Well, that's my list, guys. Royal Tierra, Top Hats, Mech Helmets, Worn Blankets, Flower Crowns, Arctic Hoods, Scullies, Cupid Wings, raccoon tails, diamond spikes, and I just realized that I forgot an item. So, um, my, my new number one on my list is mm, probably my favorite den item ever. And if you've been watching me for a while, I'm sure you can guess what it is. Can you see him driving his Ferrari? Cammy's frog. Cammy's frog definitely should be rare. I mean, come on. Are you ever going to put this in Jam Art Furniture Animal Jam? Because if you do, I quit. I'm done. I'm through with Animal Jam. I quit. Forget it. Goodbye. See ya. Peace out. Holla at ya. And Cammy's frog actually is rare on Play Wild. Animal Jam Play Wild, this is rare Cammy's frog and duh it should be rare on animal jam also this is an epic item it has a lot of meaning behind it a lot of symbology symbol symbolism symbol some stuff right so Kenny's frog should be made rare i think so and if you don't agree with me then you're wrong period end of story game over well hey that's gonna do it for every everybody this video watching thanks for doing that don't forget to click that thumbs up button guys post a comment let me know what you think about my top 10 slash top 11 list what do you think about the items is there anything you would have left off or something else that you would have put on Maybe I'll do a part two of this video because I'm already thinking of items in my head. And I'm like, oh man, I should have included that item. Ugh. So yeah, I'll probably do a part two of this video. Hmm, yeah. So let me know your ideas about other items that you think should be rare. Okay? Alright. Well, that's going to do it for this video, everybody. Thanks so much for watching, and I love you.